Greetings from Radius Theme. Today we are going to learn how to create different PostGrid layouts by Elementor. We will use the PostGrid Elementor plugin to create various PostGrid designs. So without further ado, let's move into Plugin tab from the dashboard. Click Add New. Then go to the search tab and type PostGrid Elementor. You will find the PostGrid, shortcode, Elementor add-on for PostGrid by Radius Theme. Click Install. Wait few seconds to get install. Now activate the add-on. Your PostGrid add-on is activated. See what unique features are included from the add-on details. This is a free version add-on. But you can purchase the pro version for many premium features. At first we will set our PostGrid settings. From settings, go to other settings. You will find the options to choose short code or Elementor to create PostGrid. You can left it in default mode for both option. I choose Elementor mode now. If you choose shortcode mode, you can enable the load script only shortcode page. If you don't want fun awesome, you can disable from here. Many other options are in pro version. Let us create a page for post grid. From page tab, click add new. Give a title like the post grid element or add on. Then click publish. After publishing the page, click edit with Elementor. Now wait few seconds to load the Elementor panel. Then we will see all the options fetched from PostGrid add-on. First, you will find the PostGrid tab, where all the PostGrid types are available. We have Grid Layout Type, List Layout Type, Grid Hover Layout, Slider Layout Type. To ease your PostGrid experience, let us create a grid layout and find out all the settings. Drag and drop the grid layout. You will see lots of post and grid format. On the left you have all the tools options. First we will see the content tab. Under this tab we have many layout styles. Choose any style you like. You can configure your layout from layout options. Choose how many columns to display from column. Align your text from text align. Now under query build, we have post source. We can filter this layout from common filters. Like we can mention how many posts to display from limit option. We set 20, now it's showing only 20 posts. Under offset option, we can exclude any number posts from the beginning. Let's see an example. If you want to skip first two posts from the beginning, just type 2 and see first two posts have excluded. Under Advanced Filter, we can filter the posts by category. Tags. By author and keyword also. You can filter the posts in OR, and not relational way from taxonomy's relation option. Under Pro version you can filter from date range. Under Pro version you can select OR by post format. You can sort posts in ascending and descending order. Select your post status. You can end your sticky posts from Pro feature. Under Pagination, first enable Pagination. See below, Pagination is activated. Mention, how many page you want to display. You can choose Pagination type like Ajax Pagination in Pro version. Under Links tab, you can keep the links or set no links for the posts. If you choose no links, all links are gone from the posts. If you keep the links, you can select links target and can enable or disable thumbnails. Let's see layout settings. At first we have field selection tab. Here you can enable or disable fields like section title, post author, categories. 
post comment count, then pro features like post view count and many more. If you enable section title from field selection, you can customize section title style. Change title source. Select title text in custom title. Choose header tag for title. Under post title, you can select heading, change visibility style and hover under line. See the changes. Let's configure post thumbnail. Select from where you want to show thumbnail under media source. Set your thumbnail image size. Choose your image hover animation. Like you can zoom in, zoom out. You can enable light box and default image options from Pro Feature. Under Excerpt tab, you can select Post Text Type in Character, Word Format. You can limit how many excerpt word or character to display. Under Metadata, you can enable or disable meta options for posts. You can enable or disable author settings. Separate meta content using meta separator. Choose your meta category format. You can change the style of your posts from style settings. For section title, you can change the typography, title color, title background color. For post title, you can change the margin measurement. Padding measurement. Typography settings. Alignment settings. Change title color. Title background. Change thumbnail styles. Like image width, height, margin measurement. Overlay style. Background type. Change excerpt style. LA typography. Alignment, spacing. Color. Change metadata style. Spacing. Many color and measurement settings. For pagination style. Change spacing, alignment. Typography format. Button padding, border radius, color, background. Card style for grids. Change card gap measurement. Card padding. Border radius. Enable or disable box shadow. See the changes. Save the changes and see the live preview in new tab. Wow! All the changes in the post grid looks fabulous. I believe you have learned the settings of post grid layout. Now, let's try the list layout. Just drag and drop the list layout on the page. Great list layout appears. 
most of the settings under Content tab are same like Post Grid Layout. Even the Settings option are also same like Enabling or Disabling Format. You can change excerpt limit like before. Also you can choose different layout styles. See all the changes happening. The grid hover layout is similar to post grid layout except for the hovering effect. On the other hand, all the settings, options and style are same like before. So what do you think, isn't it so easy to create PostGrid using the Elementor add-on? Create PostGrid for your blog, news website magazine website and many different niches. I hope you have understand the video very well. If you face any problem, do comment below. Please subscribe us and like our video. Radius theme always bring innovative WordPress products. If you need more help, you can visit our website for product documentation. Thanks for watching.